Now, if you are wondering how motion capture works, you're in the right place. Simon has got loads of sensors stuck to his body, hundreds. And this here is Gary Roberts, who's from Vicon Motion Systems. And uh, he knows all the answers to all the questions. So uh, how does image capture work? Um, basically, we have 10 special cameras um, surrounding Simon. Right, and yeah. we're using those cameras to film the motion of just his markers on that rather fetching black lycra piece. <laughs> it's attractive, isn't it? It's attractive. It's a beauty. <laughs> and we then take the motion from all of those cameras and right. turn it into 3D and then can apply that motion onto a, uh, an animated character as we're showing here. Oh, you make it sound so easy. It's yeah. amazing the way it just captures every little movement. How many sensors has he got on him? Uh, we have about 50 on Simon at the moment. Right, OK. Um, Polar Express was shot with around 200. <gasps> Whoa, that's a lot. So how does it feel, Si? God, it's absolutely extraordinary because, I mean, literally every movement I'm performing it's been replicated on the computer screens there. It's very, very odd. But Gary, tell us, why was it decided to use motion capture on the Polar Express? I think the, the main reason was uh, Robert Zemeckis, the director, and Tom Hanks wanted to get the feel of a live action movie, uh -huh. but with a, a more traditional CG animation right. um, look and feel. He's um, just a blobby red man here. Can we actually turn him into a character? Sure, we can turn him into anything. Hey, yeah. Hey, boss. Slam, Slam dunk. dunk, yeah. <clears throat> Way, <laughs> nice. What else have you got in there? An astronaut. Do some giant steps like on the moon. I'm trying to I'm trying to get into the sort of weightlessness yeah. feel here, Con. <laughs> yeah. Well we have Simon's favourite character coming up. Is it? Oh, you're a lady. <laughs> How does it feel being a lady, Simon? Well, uh, not, not for the first time on Blue Beer. What's going on with the voice? Um, I've, never, I've never been a virtual reality lady, that's can we, for sure. Can we see my favourite? That's the Viking one. You want the Viking yeah. back again? We can do that. Hey, yeah. Dig that pot belly. <laughs> Love your hairy back, Si. That's very yeah. attractive. Sorry, I forgot to wax earlier today, but uh, <laughs> got a little bit, of a, uh, little bit of a belly going on here. OK, the big question is, where's all this going to end? I don't think it is actually. I think really? motion capture is just a tool to be used um, for uh, animation and some of our customers are using it to recreate deceased actors. <gasps> um, they're using it for all sorts of feature work with Whoa. animals as well as people. Scarily impressive. And one day you guys may be replaced yourself. Oh, I don't like the sound of that. <laughs> <laughs> it's very worrying. Gary, thank you for coming in. Thank you to the guys as well. Uh, Matt, what do you think about the Viking look? You like? Well, I have to say I'm enjoying the, uh, the moustache. I think that's a good look for you, Sai. I do, it's great.